Welcome to another training session of STL language. In today's tutorial we will see how we can write STL code for the time. As you can see that I have written a code in ladder logic for the timer D1 and it is on delay timer and it is starting by I2.0 and its preset value is 10 seconds and can, we can reset this timer by I2.0 input and its output will be Q4.0. And its current value will be saved in a memory worker. So let's see how we can write a code in STL language for this timer. First of all, we have to enable the timer D1. So it can be enabled using an input. So first of all, we will use AND operation and I2.1. FR command is used to enable a timer. So FR T1. We can put a comment here. Enable timer T1. The next thing is to start this timer. So we can use again AND operation I. We are starting this timer by I2.0 input. I Okay. We will use the load command L to load the preset to load the preset value in the timer T1 load S so our preset time will be 10 seconds and it is this time and this timer value is loaded into the cumulative register. 10 second preset time. The next thing is to start this timer. So to start we use ST. ST command is used to start as a on delay timer. Start on delay timer T1. The next thing is to reset this timer. So for resetting, we will use again and a command and I 2.2 and R will be used for resetting the timer R T1. Reset timer T1. Now the output is Q 4.0. So we will use again and command and T1 okay if the T1 timer is over it will equal to Q4.0 so it will turn on our profile the next thing is to show this the current value of this timer so we will use the load command so we will use the load command l l t1 it is it will load the current time current value of the timer t1 and transfer it to memory work then okay okay now it is done, we will load this code in the simulator. Now to start the timer first, I have to enable this timer. So I can enable it using input I2.1, which is here. So it will enable our timer. The other thing is to start the timer we have to load its preset value and start the timer using st command so both of these functions will be executed using i2.0 input so as you can see that as i turn on this input i2.0 
the timer starts and its current value is showing in the M memory word 10. Okay, so let's see what happens. The timer reaches 10 seconds, our output cube 4.0 is on. Now if I now if I start again as you can see that it starts again and if I press the reset button reset is I2.2 it's reset is the timer value you can see that by pressing the reset button it is resetting the timer So that's how we can write the STL code for the timer on delay timers and this is the list for the codes we can write the time for the pulse timers and preemptive timers and on delay of delay timer using this code we have to just replace here instead of this ST on, on delay time we, have, we can use these codes to run off delay or redemptive timers on delay timers as well. So that's today's tutorial. I hope you like it. Please do subscribe to my channel. And till next video, take care and goodbye.